Good Saturday evening, everybody. It's Jeff from Treeline Model Works. Uh, tonight, we're going to do our first update on the PBY5 Catalina. Uh, and but before we do that, I need to give a shout out to Papa Dan. I uh, did receive my koozie uh, in, the, in the mail uh, this past week. This was uh, from the giveaway for pa Papa Dan's 1,000 subscribers. And so I did get did get mine. Thank you very much, Papa Dan. Uh, it's great. Love it. Appreciate you sending that. Okay, so we've got uh, several, uh, got a few things done on the, the plane. Uh, not a lot, but uh, I think enough to, to show you a good update tonight. Um, so let me get the, let me get the um, camera flipped around and we'll show you what we've done. Okay, so first off, we got the, we got the cockpit done. Um, there is not a lot of detail uh, on this cockpit. Um, you see it's got the two pilots uh, and the flight sticks, the two flight sticks. Uh, there is no instrument panel, um, no decals for the instrument panel. Uh, that's pretty much it. Um, let me zoom in here a little bit and see if we can uh, see if this will focus a little bit. It may not. I did do a little bit of detail on the the pilots, but uh, my camera's not wanting to focus. So um, you'll see. I, I, I'll show you just a couple of, of still photos that I took um, that of the close up of the detail on the pilots, uh, and so you can see that. Uh, the front gun uh, is done. I just uh, did the barrel in gunmetal. Uh, did the the rest of the gun in flat black, uh, and then just did some dry brushing with some metallic silver uh, on the rest of the gun, just to to bring out a little bit of detail. And again, that's not focusing very well. So. Uh, can't really see too much detail. That's a little bit better. And the, uh, the gun uh, does rotate. Uh, and so there is that. And then this gun actually has a, uh, a canopy that will go over it. Uh, I've got the, the canopy is masked uh, already. Uh, and we'll get that painted. And that will go over the top of that. So there is that. There's the the cockpit. And then on the fuselage uh, just uh, painted the insides with uh, just the uh, cockpit green, interior cockpit green. Uh, one side and then the other. So haven't really done much else with the with the fuselage yet. Uh, there are there's quite a bit of glass on this on this plane. Uh, this is the top uh, canopy, and again we've got that masked off, uh, ready for paint. Uh, and then there are some side canopies uh, that will go uh, here, uh, and so we've got those. Got those masked off as well. Uh, there's two of those. There's one for each side. Um, so there are those. And then everything else really is just in uh, in primer right now. So there's not really not much else to show. So as I said, a little bit of progress. Um, I have made also a decision on the paint scheme and the, the decals. Um, I am not going to use the, uh, the original decals that came with it. Uh, I really don't want to do this as a Coast Guard plane. I would really rather do it as a, as a Navy aircraft, uh, specifically uh, one of the uh, PBYs that, uh, that flew in the Pacific Theater uh, from Pearl Harbor uh, on. Uh, and so I am going to, it's going to be painted, uh, and I'm going to, I'll show a, a couple of pictures here 
in, in, in a scheme similar to, uh, to what you see here. Uh, and then um, I'm going to order some aftermarket decals uh, that will also go as uh, the U.S. Navy um, decals. And so um, that is my plan. So I've got the, um, I've got the paint for the underside. Uh, I went last night to Hobby Lobby and was able to get uh, this, the Model Master acrylic. This is the gold gray. Uh, this is the, the color that will go on the bottom um, of the wings and the bottom of the fuselage. And then the, the blue color I had to order uh, from eBay and hopefully it will be here next week. So um, kind of uh, at a standstill for some of my, my paint work, uh, but we'll continue to to do as much as we can till the paint gets here. Uh, anyway, that is the plan uh, for the PBY-5. Uh, and so really enjoying this build. While there's not a terrible lot of detail on it, so far the parts have gone together really, really well. Hasn't been a lot of flash for a, a, a kit as old as this is. So I've been really pleased with that. Anyway, uh, that's all we've got for tonight. I uh, hope you all have a great rest of your weekend. Uh, and we'll see you on the next update. Y'all have a good one. Talk to you later. Bye.